On this episode of Trek and Beyond, I'll be going to Chengdu in Sichuan Province, China. Chengdu not only offers many things to do in the city, but you can also take amazing day trips outside of the city as well. Qingshan Mountain, which is considered the birthplace of Taoism, and Mount Imaishan Scenic Area, including Lishan Giant Buddha, which are UNESCO World Heritage Sites. Chengdu is an officially recognized UNESCO City of Gastronomy. It is UNESCO's first ever city of gastronomy in Asia. Some famous dishes include Sichuan Hot Pot, Mapu Tofu, which is bean curd, Sichuan dumplings and chili oil, and Dan Dan noodles. Sichuan food is famous for its hot and spicy flavor. For the most part, it all contains Sichuan peppers and chili peppers. Be prepared to experience a different kind of Chinese language when visiting Sichuan. The dialect is known as Sichuanese and is sometimes difficult to understand and tell apart. Home to the Chengdu Research Base of Giant Panda Breeding. The Giant Panda is a Chinese national treasure and is one of the rarest animals in the world. Visit Chengdu during the fall for the best experience. You avoid the hot, sweltering summers, which include many tourists. You also avoid the gloomy winters and the rainy season in the spring. I found the weather in October and November to be the most comfortable. After visiting my best friend in the Philippines, I'll be traveling from Cebu to Kunming in Yunnan Province, China, which I will transfer and then continue on to Chengdu, Sichuan to continue my adventure. Here's the center, and I'm staying here. It's called on this street here. I don't know how you say it. <laughs> but yeah, it's a nice, pretty nice area. So I met up with my friend this afternoon. I'm gonna take to like a nice traditional Sichuan dinner. And then there was like a live kitchen feed here, but it's gone now. Oh, there it is. It's like they have a can inside of the kitchen and you can just like watch them prepare the stuff. I don't know if I'd like that because <laughs> I work in the kitchen too and uh, yeah, it's kind of weird. It's crazy. <laughs> Upstairs patio where I'm staying. It's pretty cold. There's no one out here. And I'm gonna go maybe explore down there. Just a little bit of the view from up here. Okay, just leaving the place now. Pretty busy everywhere. Oh, shit, I gotta cross here. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. So scary. Right, there's a bunch of street food here. I think I'm gonna get one of these. Hot dogs, sausages, 
It's all like split like that and like with some kind of spices. Hello, Niho, Iga. Ah, okay, I think she fries it. Alright. Spicy. Cheers here. Daijan, I think I'm gonna get one of these. Some kind of cake, it looks like. Some kind of noodles, deep fried. I'm gonna get ham flavor. Oh. Ham flavor. I'll try it. Niho, we have this this ham flavor. This, kina, yeah, yeah, yeah. It looks like a like a like really like deep fried deep fried uh, noodles with like some kind of ham flavor. Right, that's what it looks like. I'm gonna taste it now. Honestly, I want to say it's like... It tastes like noodles and potato. Like deep fried something. Like pieces of bacon or ham. It's really good. The two things I've had are like really good so far. Alright, I just asked the guy, I tried my Chinese. I said in Chinese, like, what is this? And I said, I think I knew the word for noodle. And he was like, yeah, yeah, it's like something, something noodle. So I just found a place <coughs> that sells rabbit head. You can see it here. You see the teeth there? The little teeth? Yeah. Alright, I, I told myself I'll try everything. I can try everything, but I can't try a rabbit head. That's kind of, a, it's kind of, out, of out of my league there. I don't know. That's pretty crazy. No rabbit head for me. Not today at least. I used to eat this when I lived in China. It's, and I'm gonna get one of these. Because I remember I really loved eating this. Looks really good. Squid on a stick. Yeah, I'm gonna get that. That looks good. I don't understand the name of that. It says... Tasteless duck sausage. Tasteless. So that means it doesn't taste like anything or like. Okay. Lacha? Yeah, yeah, lacha. Spicy, spicy. Kui, kui. Shish here. Alright. Squid on a stick. I just asked for extra spicy. I'm probably gonna regret it tomorrow, but let's eat it. Oh my god, that squid was so spicy, my mouth's like burning, but I mean Sichuan is like home of the spiciness, so I love it. it tastes great. Alright, it's like black sesame and it's being like made into a paste. And she's giving out samples. I'm gonna try one. Kuima. It's like... Oh, it's like warm. It's like warm liquid ses black sesame. I'm gonna try it. Oh. oh man, that's so good. It tastes like sweet. Oh my god, that's so good. Some 
Chinese guy came up to me and was like, I thought he wanted to like take a picture with me, so he like started putting the camera up. He's like going like this with me, and I thought he was taking a picture, but we were just standing there and I'm like waiting for the picture to be taken. I'm like, is this a picture or what is it? No, video. Just like awkwardly standing there. That was kind of weird. But look, there's a red chili peppers stuffed with white sesame seeds and peanuts. There it is. All right, I'm gonna try this. My stomach's probably not gonna agree with me tomorrow, but. Oh well. Okay, it's just like. Like deep fried. Crispy. Everything crispy. Sesame seeds and the outer shells. Chili pepper. Not really that spicy, but. It's a nice snack. Never had that before. It's pretty good. Right, I needed something to wash all of that down, all that food. I got this like. It's like hot, like fruits, and some kind of beans. It's like all warm, and then you like put it in this cup. Mm. It's really nice. It's nice and warm and sweet. It's like. Oh, can you explain it? The apples. It's like warm apple and like bean. I think it's like bean or something. That's really good. I need something to wash all that down. I never had this. So yeah, it's just like fruits that are like warm. I can't really tell what else is in there, but it's like tofu. Tofu, I just got two. I'm gonna give it a try. I think this might be the last. You can dip it in this if you want. And I'm gonna try it like this. Tofu. Good. It's good, it's cold. It was deep fried, it's cold, but I'm not a big fan of it. Actually it's not. It's okay. If it was like warm, it'd be good. But it smells nice.